Hello, howdy, folks. How are y'all doing? This is Reese or Brushyette Cub, and welcome back to another fantastic episode of our Hexit Let's Play adventure. Yeah, that's right. I'm still rocking the fantastic, and uh, I'm not really sure how long that's going to stick around. Probably until I start a video and forget about it, and then it'll never happen again. But uh, I have heard your cries in the comment sections. Reese, return to us. Make some more videos. Why don't you make videos every day, Reese? Well, guys, the answer is simple. I'm a I'm a very busy man. I'm a very, very busy man. I have a full-time job. You know, I've got a wife, I got kids. Okay, I don't. But I do have a job that keeps me very busy, as well as some uh, some other activities, such as babysitting my niece, who's been in town all week, and we've had a great time. I'm actually, after this, going to take her to town for ice cream, which ought to be... What the heck is that? Are you guys seeing this? This thing up here in the sky? What on earth? Is that, an, is that a meteor? Where'd it go? Where did it go? That was so strange. You guys saw the yellow dot too, right? Is it behind the sun? No, I don't see it behind the sun anymore. It was going that way though, wasn't it? I'm not crazy, am I guys? You all saw it too? Falling star maybe? I guess the best we can do now is just chill and wait and see if we hear like a big kaboom. That was so strange. That completely threw me off topic here. Anyway, so I asked, I asked? In the last video, I asked if you guys wanted me to move onto the ship. And uh, you guys all said yes. Well, some of you said no, but the majority said yes. And uh, majority rules, mob rules. Here we go. We're going to move to the boat, except for we had a problem. The boat's really big, and what I wanted to do was take the boat sailing around the lake. Unfortunately, the mod that I installed to do that, link in the description, no tutorial because I'm lazy. It would not allow me to actually drive the boat around, no matter how small I tried to shrink it. Alright, I jumped into MC Edit and tried to shrink the boat down small enough to where I could actually... Um, wait a minute, it was one of those little things that float off of here. Oh, so the meteor shield bits fly into the air and then they just... Wow, wow. See, I thought I was seeing something really cool and special, but now we know. Right, so what I ended up doing was building my own boat. And I would like to show it to you guys. So let's go take a look at it. We will take our little our little guy here who cannot join us on our quest, unfortunately. Whenever you try to take off with one of these guys in the boats, he just gets butchered um, because of game physics. But I built a road here. And of course, it was it was all naturally gathered materials. I didn't I didn't use MC Edit for this. Psh, no. No, not at all. And uh, if you'll buy that, I will throw the golden gate in for free. Oh look, it's raining. All right, well, that's that's fantastic. That's right. That's very Pinocchio-esque. You lie and it rains, but I didn't lie, so lol. Anyway, welcome to the dock, and this is my boat. Stay here. I will I will try to avoid the skeleton, actually. I don't want to fight it. Oh, here it comes. Okay, uh, it's in the water now. So let's go. Oh, ow! Hey, stop that. Stop that right now. Let's go to the boat. Oh, I forgot I put stuff. Oh, no, that's in my inventory. That's right. Okay. Let's set sail to the boat. Here it is. I built it all by myself, Zs. And I need to get in back here, actually. It's not really easy to board the boat currently. What you kind of got to do is you got to jump out and go through here. But welcome aboard, people. We got all the basic necessities here in the, the cabin. We've got a chest with some more boats. Uh, a chest with nothing in it. A, a tool station to repair our tools. You know, the basic crafting table and uh, furnace. A bed to sleep away the long cold nights and then a board deck we've got your tools or weapons I guess to some food some nothing and I think this is uh, some yeah some supplies and this boat is actually steered right here with this uh, ship marker device here and I'm having a lot of trouble remembering what this mod is called but there will be links gee willikler gee willikers there will be links in the description and actually I think we're pretty much set to go we, we could just we could just sail away but uh, there's a there's a one more thing I want to grab from the cabin, and that is some Geisel in case we find like a really awesome, 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 awesome uh, chocobo we can bring it home with us. But I don't think we will. I think all the cool ones have to be bred. I know there's one in the Nether, but I don't think we're going to the Nether on this voyage. Basically, we live on an ocean biome. It, it's it's all it's crazy for us not to explore that ocean. You know, it could be fun. It could be an all right, so we just suffered from a major crash in which the whole game went kapooey. Not entirely sure what caused that one. But then again, I've given up trying to figure out what causes these random crashes. I don't care anymore. 
I just want to get to my chocobo and go home. Go away. Uh, not this again. This is what happened. This is how I crashed trying to fight a skeleton from the water. This is not... This isn't going to work. This is not going to work. <laughs> oh, gee. Oh, gee. Okay, all right. Chocobo, get me out of here. Let's go home. We're going to get some guy cell. And we're going to say goodbye to everybody. It'll be... It'll be a very sad occasion, I think. It'll, it'll be full of mourning. Possibly afternoon and night, too. That was a lousy joke. Don't laugh at that, guys. Don't laugh at that at all. Uh, if you will look to your left, you'll see where I died. Once upon a time. You guys might remember that from one of the pre-episodes, I think. And uh, there's a marker to find out if we're protected. We are. That's, that's a nice thing to have. Alright. Up here we go. And... Right. Get some guy cell. Who's dying? What what is dying? Where is it dying? I don't want to know. Sounds like a skeleton. It deserves to death. Alrighty guys. So are y'all ready to uh you ready to try this again? What happens when I mate? Let's try a, a a male yellow one with a hold on. No wait. Wait, hold on. Who here is new? Are you who are you? You're ice. Okay, so we haven't tried you before. So let's try a male white one. Oh dear. Oh wait, we haven't tamed you yet, have we? Right. Okay, now you're tamed. We're gonna name you... Garnet? No! We already have an ice, so we're gonna name this one... Ice Tea, because that sounds manly. Alright, so Ice Tea... You... And you... Make Babby! And it's yellow. Why do I even... Why do I even bother? Ice has failed me. Ice T has failed me. Aurora has failed me. You've all failed me. All of you. All of you have failed me. Um, stay. Stay. You... You... I don't even care about you. You're not what I wanted. It's not fair. Life isn't fair. Your face isn't fair. Let's close this. What... What is happening? Close. Dang it. Close. Well, you know what? We, we didn't really expect that to work. I think we pretty much just accepted the fact that this game is against us when it comes to breeding. And I'm okay with that. Guys, I'm going to be leaving on an adventure. I can see you really don't care. All right. I'll go upstairs and say goodbye to the, the other animals and see if I can get a reaction out of them. Um, cows, I'm going on a journey. I will be back eventually. I'm going to go check out the ocean. Okay, um, no, nah, I'm not even going to bother. They don't care. What do they care? Uh, we've had some good times together, Nether Portal. Good times. Like when those horrible spiders from the depths of hell came out and tried to kill us. And then people in the comments got mad at me for saying they were spiders from the depths of hell because apparently that was cursing. Um, yeah, good times. Good times. Bed. Wonderful bed. I'm going to sleep in you one more time. And it's still raining. I I don't want it to rain. That's that's not good weather for setting. Se oh. Well, all right then. Perfect. So it's a beautiful sunrise. It's a beautiful day. The sun is up and the music's playing. And even if it did start raining, you wouldn't hear me complaining. Um, because I've got Michael Bublé to keep me company in my head, where I keep him. After I kidnapped him. What? No. Alright. Staying focused here. Staying on track. Staying sane. Let's get back to the boat. And uh, please excuse my cold weather voice. It, it is starting to get cold in Texas. I know. I know. It's cold everywhere else already. It's starting down here though. And whenever the weather changes, uh, I get a whole new slew of al allergies. And and this, this is my winter allergies. They weaken my immune system so that I get my winter cold. And when I get my winter cold, I'm, I'm sick for like two weeks. And by that time, the cold weather is fully on and I can pretty much handle myself. <coughs> it's getting worse as I talk. All right, hold on. There we go. All right. We are ready to set sail for the adventure of a lifetime. Bum. Dum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. I'll probably just add music. I don't need to sing. All right. Goodbye, world. World that I've come to know and love. Oh, hold on. Somebody told me there's a hexical flower over there. Maybe I should go get it before I leave. 
Yeah, let's sail over there. And I'll just hop out real quick, run over there, I'll get the hexical flower if I can find it. And, to be honest, I don't know what to do with it, but people talk about it a lot, so I figure it's gotta be important. Like, every few videos, it's like, you ran past a hexical flower, there's a hexical flower at black, 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 black. And, uh, instead of just pausing the video and giving me the coordinates off the minimap, they give me the time in which they saw it in the video, which means I have to go back and rewatch the video and then check the coordinates. It's a bit ridiculous. Watch what happens when I right-click. I end up up here. Hadn't figured out why, but that's why I built this, so that I wouldn't keep falling and hurting myself. Alright. Let's... Do we want to take a boat? Eh... Let's not... No, that's a, no, that's a waste of effort. There's the boat over there that we couldn't take because it's too big. Ooh, ooh, we're going into mysterious waters without any weapons or any resources. This is a bad idea. What with the alligator there. I could probably swim back to the boat and get a sword. You'll notice I'm not doing it though, and that is because I am I'm too lazy and impatient to swim all the way back and get this thing. So let's see. I think it was over here someplace that they told me it was. Um, berries. Gator. Okay, sure. We don't really need any more food, but I just kind of feel like while well, I'm here and it's here, might as well. Whoa, check that out. How do you break one of these? Dude, I look, that looks weird. Hold on to that though, that's pretty cool. Okay, and some of this stuff, which apparently people keep telling me to break this stuff and it'll give me things. Whoa, it did. What? Well, that was cool. I got cool stuff from breaking it. All right, sweet. We'll let it keep growing over here. Hexical flower. They said it was over here someplace. I cannot remember for the life of me where. Oh, gee. Okay, we're going to have to run around and look for it, I guess. I I can't imagine it being a big thing. Otherwise, I probably would have noticed it myself. But they say it was around here. Near the crash site of this... Oh, gee. I should have brought some sort of resources with me. Hey, let's grab some shrooms while we're here. I want to make some shroom soup later. See, I'm worried that I'm just going to walk right past it. We'll just make a loop around it. Is that it? Is that... What is... Ah! Hexabus! Hex... Hexbiscus. Maybe that's what they wanted me to get. What is that? Hexical essence. I have some of that back at the house. I don't know where or how I got it, but I, I've already seen this before. Is this what I was supposed to be looking for, guys? They said I used it to make armor, so I can make a hexical diamond, which can be used to make a tribal helmet, a tribal chest piece, some tribal leggings. All right, or I can make a thief's hood. Some more thief's outfit. Oh, dude. Dude. Oh, my gosh. <coughs> yeah, I see. If I wasn't coughing and stuff, this would be way cooler. Ah! 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 What? What? What's wrong with you, dude? Take a chill pill. I'm not hurting you. Look, I just took a flower. It's just a flower. You want the flower back that badly? Well, you're not gonna get it. Okay, so get over yourself. I wonder if there's any more of them around here. Are they... Chief, where's this guy's after me? This guy's out... This guy's out for kill. This guy's out for the kill. There's another skull head down there. Um... I've never actually been over here before. It's kind of cool. I, and I feel compelled to break these whenever I see them. Just to see what kind of cool stuff I get. Um, we should probably head back to the boat now. Yeah, we're just kind of wandering around now. And I don't really see any more hexabuscus. Hectabuscus, whatever it's called. We should, we should go back to the boat now. Because we do have, we have a quest that we're on. You guys going to get mad at me too? No? Okay. We have a quest that needs to be completed. Or at least started. We haven't even really started the quest. We just kind of sailed our little Viking-esque boat over here and had a look around. That's not really a journey. That's more just like a like a, a, a Sunday afternoon cruise. Do people around the world do that? Or is that just a Texas thing? Like a Sunday, a Sunday afternoon cruise where you just get the family in the car and you head out to the back roads. Maybe get some ice cream or some sweet tea and you just cruise around and you look at like, cows and the woods and deers and our, our deer I should say not deers that's one thing that's always bothered me is when people say deers because it's it's clearly deer Legos you can call them Legos I don't care about that that's fine but deers come on now that's just way too redneck then again this is Texas I think we do have sort of a, a god-given right to mispronounce things uh, however we please and because uh, we're rednecks and rednecks have that ability Alrighty, forward. Forward we go. Ever forward. Ever onward. 
What is that over there? That's an interesting looking flower. <laughs> this whole trip is just going to become me stopping to look at flowers. All right, I say we head in a direction. I don't know which one. Whoa, what is that on the minimap? That looks cool. Let's head that way. Whoa, check it out. It's like, whoa. So, twin spirals. Okay. Dying Enderman. Whoa. Dude. You want to talk about a pirate ship? Now that is a pirate ship. What is the red dot down there, though? On the minimap. It says I'm looking right at it now. What is that? Oh, that's a marker. Right. It's nothing special. Check this thing out, though. Dude. See, if I'd known this was here, I would have just sailed out here and stole this boat. Instead of having to build my own. I don't see any pirates aboard. Let's go check it out. Let's go do it. Let's go... Let's leave this stuff behind. Okay, so we got... Food. We'll drop in here. We'll actually take some carrots with us, though. Uh, I guess we'll leave this stuff in here as well. It's all kind of plant-esque. The rest of these, we'll just kind of toss in here. So we don't know what else to do with it. Sword, give me the... We'll take Cubs Long Reach. And... Mm, we probably won't need the bow. Go ahead and take an axe, though. Alright, let's go check this thing out. And look at that, they even have a little ladder on the side for us to get up easier. Okay. I'm trying to find... Oh, gee. See, now I hear stuff. I hear stuff spawning or burning or something. Whoa! Blazes aboard a ship. This is a bad idea. This, it, it seems to me like putting creatures that burn aboard something may- <laughs> uh, Alright, so we crashed again, which is nothing to be surprised about. As I was saying, it seems to me like a giant floating wooden ship with, um, creepers... And particularly these guys aboard is just a bad idea. So we could just drop down there and let all heck break loose. But I think we're better off if we attack like this. Now hold on. Let's get back over here. There's no easy way to get aboard my boat. I wish I would thought of an easier way to get aboard my boat. We're going to need a pickaxe though. And uh, we're going to see if we can't take out these spawners and see if there's treasure aboard. Because you never know what you're going to find. We might find some like awesome treasure in here. This could be the coolest thing ever. Coolest find of our lives. Do I not have a pickaxe? Wow. I neglected to bring a pickaxe with me. Okay, well, that's fine. Because you know what? We have to go back to base anyway because I realized I forgot to bring my backpack. So, at the end of this episode... Oh, you know what would be a good idea? You know what would be a good idea? Meteor pickaxe. Right, let's see if that works. I gotta go back after this episode. I'll go back to base. We'll get some more stuff. Apparently, this doesn't work. Um... Maybe I'm doing it wrong. You can make armor. You can make tools. Oh, you gotta use iron. Okay, well yeah, that makes sense, I guess. There we go. Meteorite pickaxe. And... Throw all of this back in there. We'll go back after this episode. And then we'll, we'll officially set sail tomorrow. This will be... Or not tomorrow, in the next episode. This is like the beta... The beta test of our boat. Gee, everything down there seems to be dying. That's that's a good sign. Creepers out. Okay. Blazes. Are out of there. Now I just gotta take care of what's left. And I wish I had brought my bow now. Because I could just sit up there and pick them off. But, under the circumstances, I don't think that's gonna be a possibility. So I guess I'll have to, I'll have to do it like this. And this is fine. This will work. This will work. Oh dear, okay, I fell. I fell and then there's another spawner down here that I was unaware of. In case you guys didn't know, there is another spawner. There is another spawner. There is another spawner and there's a lot of monsters down here and we're gonna die. We're gonna die. We are going to die. Oh no, they're, they're out, they're out, they're aboard. Okay, this isn't, this isn't going well at all. Overboard, we go. Okay, um, right, so, not the best of plans, won't lie. Not the best of plans, but also not the worst. It's fine. The whole boat's on fire. That's okay, though. Let's see if we can... Oh, gee. Oh, gee. Oh, gee. Oh, gee. All right. Let's just sit back and watch the world burn. That's... That's... Some men just want to see that happen. 
Some men just want to watch the world burn. Yes, I'm not one of those men. I would rather kill all the monsters and then take over the world. But under the circumstances, I think we're doing the only thing we can. And... I really wish I could get to that last spawner there, but it is kind of submerged in water. I don't know if that makes a difference. Alright, let's create our own entrance here. Sweet. Ah, oh, gee. Ah, oh, gee. Alright, well that didn't work the way I had hoped it would. Gee, where are these guys coming from? This is ridiculous. Okay, swimming away again. Swimming away again. We, we, this isn't gonna, this isn't gonna work. We're gonna have to think of a better plan. Better strategy underway. So am I the only one who thinks it's a little bit strange that there's a boat, a pirate ship, clearly a pirate ship, that is dominated by mostly monsters? Am I the only one who thinks that's a little strange? All right, monsters. Oops, okay, that didn't work. Oh. Blaze is going down. Blaze is down. And I'm <laughs> getting my arrows back because of the armor. Fantastic. All right. What I really want to look for is these skeletons. Let's take them out. Oh, gee, that was a complete miss. It's okay, though. Swim back up. We should probably be able to one-shot this guy. Yes! One last blaze. And another. Right. I keep forgetting that there is still a spawner. All right. We've got this, though. We're here now. Spawner is ours. Spawner has been destroyed, people. The world is our oyster. The world is... Oh, there's another spawner up there, though. Gee... Go away! Okay, let's see. Let's see what we can do about this one. Come on. Come on. Yes! All right, I think we've officially... No, there's one more spawner up there now. Okay. If I didn't know any better, I'd say these things were just, like, spawning randomly. All right, goodbye to the zombies. Zombies are now no more. Oh, dear. All right, it's fine. We're going to fight them off now. Where's the where's the long reach? There it is. It's behind the carrot. Makes absolute sense. Of course it is. All right, everything will now die. I hereby declare you all future dead members of this, this expedition. Including you, Mr. Skeleton. You are dead. You are dead to me. You are all dead to me. Who's left? Is there, is it, I think there's one... I, I thought there was another Blaze flying around out there, but maybe I got him too. Alright. And another zombie underneath the boat. Right? Kind of can't really decide what he's going to do. This is fine. Take him out too. How many, how many arrows am I missing? Ooh. I lost ten arrows. I know that they're around on the boat someplace, or at least underneath the boat. What if I can like dive down deep and find them? These aren't mine. That's mine though. Oh wow. Okay. Um There's a lot of stuff down here. We're gonna drown though, so we gotta figure out a way to get air down here. I think I know a way. There we go. Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! I am victorious. Well guys, I sailed all the way. From the pirate ship to here, had this nice little chat, only to realize that I wasn't recording audio anymore. That's right, Mr. Chocobo. So basically what happened was I found all my arrows. Turns out arrows ghost. Like, I found a whole bunch on the seafloor that weren't there. But as soon as I swam back up to the boat, they all like, boop, 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 into my inventory. Can't explain that. Don't want to explain that. Uh, didn't find anything aboard the burning boat. Um, so all we really got was stuff that we got from killing the bad guys, which is pretty useless. I came back here because I wanted to get a proper pickaxe, a proper Tinker's Construct pickaxe, as well as a backpack. In the next video, we will set sail for real. Consider this sort of the beta test. I'm gonna go edit this and see how much of this action- Whoa. What? That was weird. Weird bodily action. I think I just tried to burp, but it didn't quite work. Wow, weird. Right, so I'm gonna go back. I'm going to see how much of this actually got recorded and how much of it didn't. Try to edit up the video. If it doesn't make any sense, well, you know why. It's because this mod crashes constantly. But uh, thank you all for watching. God bless you. God bless Texas. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye.